Hi, this is an old photocopy machine motor and it's damaged. Moving on to its ratings, voltage is 24 volts, power is 64.7 watts and RPM is 180 rotations per minute. Moving on to the damages, as you can see the shaft is bent plus if you have a closer look over here, you can see this part of the PCB is damaged so the circuit is incomplete from here to this point. Now, there can also be some other faults, but to know that for sure, we will have to open it up and have a closer look at it. Next level. So that's the rotor. As you can see, it contains four ferrite magnets and uh, this is your armature winding. Beautiful as always. These, uh, as you can see, are the FETs, which stands for field effect transistors. So let's open it further. Here, as you can see how thick the copper wires are. Here you can see the breakage, you can see all of it is damaged, so I will have to repair it. So it's all dry now. Level. 
So guys, I straightened it up as much as I could. Let's hope it works fine. Here as you can see the gearbox is fully complete and that's the first time I did the alignment type of job. You see it's a little wobbly but uh, I did the best I could. Much better than before uh, like nobody gets perfect in their first time. So much better than before. Now to test if it runs or not, first you will have to know about its connections. Take the first red wire and connect it together with the fourth one which is also red. Next you will need a 500 ohms resistor. Next connect one terminal of the 500 ohm resistor together with the joint. Next is we have to take the last wire which is orange here and connect it to the other end of the resistor something like this next out of these black wires you have to take the first one and connect it together with the orange one next short circuit all the black wires except for the first one you see that's the first one it's disconnected rest are shorted after that simply take a 24 volts power supply and take the positive wire which is a white one here and connect it to the first red wire. Next take the black wire which is negative and connect it to the black wire of this motor. Now all you are left with is one single wire which is the field sensing wire. Turning on the supply here as you can see it's flashing 24.3 volts so cutting off the wires that are not needed i.e. blue and red now take this disconnected black wire and touch it to anything metallic You can see the shaft is still wobbly. Now because the shaft was wobbly so I'm going to use another gearbox. An identical piece that I found in the scrap market. This is the old one. Thank you. 
Now let's test it again. You can also start it by touching this wire to the bundle. The talk is very strong. So guys, that's all for today's video. Please hit like and don't forget to share and subscribe. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.